Each planet in this quadrant fell to the corrupting influence of the Skeleton King Worm's passage. Each one virtually laid to waste in this corrupted zone. We have to end this before any more damage is done to the universe. I'm picking up faint traces of the worm's energy. I believe I can precisely calculate its present location. And if we do that, we might be able to launch a surprise attack coming out of Hyperboost Warp. That's just crazy enough to work. Power up Hyperboost engines. Affirmative. Monkey team, prepare for warp. On my command, five, four. What's happening? We're veering off course. An evil force has taken over the robots. Should have seen that coming. What? This can't be. According to my data, it seems as if the super robot is in control. While exploring the outskirts of the city, I discovered an abandoned super robot. It was then my life was transformed by the mysterious power of climbing. The robot monkeys were awakened, and I, Shiro, made their leader. Our quest, save Shigazoom City from the evils of the Skeleton King. Super Robot Monkey Team, Hyper Falls, go! Fighting any evil thing at Shigazoom's home! Super Robot Monkey Team, Analysis reports that we've landed on Kabiri Takara, a planet in the corrupted zone. It was once rich in metals, but has been largely depleted for quite some time. What on Shigazoom could have made the super robot come here? Perhaps the super robot's needs brought him here. To this run-down rock? Instruments detect no life forms. Are you sure about that? There's absolutely no sign of any biological entity. Funhouse mirror. Monkey team, ready for battle. Wait, it's not after us. Gibson, enhance the image. What is that? Turned himself into a slingshot. Impressive. Ooh, that's gotta hurt.
You're welcome. After him. We lost him. I can track his quasar energy reading. Quasar energy reading from that direction. Cybernetic monkeys? I can scarcely believe my ocular interface. I concur. The prototype. It has returned. The prototype? You mean you know where the super robot came from? Of course. It came from right here. From this very laboratory. And I was one of its creators. You say you're one of the creators. Three great minds work together to create the ultimate fighting robot. The Super Robot was our first success, or it would have been if you hadn't stolen it. Stolen? Whoa, hold on a micro. We didn't take him. I found the Super Robot abandoned on Sugazoom with the monkeys inside, okay? Yeah, we just woke up in him. You are able to control the prototype. Take a seat. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Dr. Takayuchi. You've arrived at a very crucial moment. That robotic menace out there is trying to destroy me. Oh, don't worry. We took out that big bully. No, you destroyed one of my robots. It was protecting me from that little plague of malfunctioning circuitry. Say what now? The robots on this planet are controlled by my brain, except for the Prometheus 5. When we first started the Prometheus project, we worked together as one, pooling all our genius. Even so, it took 15 years. Until finally, the Prometheus prototype was complete. Then, one of my colleagues mysteriously disappeared, and so did the prototype. Professor Maezono and I carried on and improved our designs. Each model became more compact and even more deadly. Finally, we reached the culmination of all our work, the Prometheus 5. We had created the deadliest fighting robot in the universe. This is all rather extraordinary and incredibly fascinating, but I'm curious as to how you came to be a disembodied brain. We were in the midst of a crucial experiment when the Prometheus 5 malfunctioned, causing an explosion that destroyed the laboratory and me. My body was gone. But my brain managed to survive. Sadly, Professor Maizono was not as fortunate. Now our insane creation will annihilate anything that comes near it. Strange. Didn't try to destroy us. The Prometheus 5. It must be stopped. Use the prototype to destroy him! To the Super Robot! with an 
Antenna Blast! The Antenna Blast isn't responding. Got nothing! Target system is not responding! None of the weapon systems are! Oh no! Here he comes! No use. Oh, no. He's inside the super robot brain. here or what? I don't have all day. I'm not so sure about this. I sense the Prometheus 5 means us no harm. Uh, did you not see the freaky wires shooting out from his head? I tried to establish a connection with you, but it didn't work. You robot monkeys are just so basic. What have you done to the super robot? He detected my electric brain frequency pattern, then came here to access my memory echelon. He was the one who activated a mind merge. His what merge? His mind, monkey boy. Yeah, yeah, I know. All right, fine. The super robot, he talks to you? You got it, Nova. My prototype here tells me Gibson's supposed to be the smart one. There's no need to be rude. How did you know our names? Information Interflow. Now he knows everything about me, where he comes from, and what's happened here. And I know all about you. And I know all about you. How you've managed to destroy nearly everything else on this planet. Dr. Takeuchi warned us. Oh, really? Let's see, were you talking to a human being with a face or a disgusting heap of evil brain on a plate? It was a brain heap, for sure. Follow me. That is Dr. Takeuchi. You mean the brain was lying to us? Why would Professor Maizono pretend to be Dr. Takeuchi? Because Professor Maizono wanted you to do his dirty work. The truth is, he was building the ultimate fighting robot for one purpose, himself. I had only been activated for two days when Professor Maizono tried to transplant his evil consciousness into my robotic body. My brain, my big beautiful brain. It will soon become one with your body, and I will live forever as the ultimate machine! Dr. Takeuchi tried to stop him. No! But Professor Maizono's brain triggered a lethal power surge, destroying the laboratory and Dr. Takeuchi. Then on, I've been locked. 
locked in battle with Professor Mizono. He tries to destroy me, I keep his evil prototypes from leaving here. I won't let Dr. Takeuchi's sacrifice be in vain. <laughs> is to shut down the central computer. Okay, let's do it. You would say, Sparks. I've got your back. <laughs> Thanks. Come on, team. It's over. How right you are, you annoying little fool. I will obliterate all of you. My brain cannot be defeated. <laughs> Shot. We could use your help fighting the Skeleton King Worm. I can't. Professor Mizono is out there somewhere, and I intend to find him. I understand. Let's go. We've got a job to do. You know, you and the Super Robot make a great team. My prototype has a message for you. What is it? He says he's already part of a great team. <laughs> 